Out on the practice field, uh, uh, getting some uh, get some work done. You know, after a couple weeks, it's kind of good to just run around, get a sweat on, and uh, throw and catch the ball a little bit. Shake loose some of those cobwebs in the mind, get their minds have to think about it. Gave some guys some easy days like uh, JC and a few others. Well, you know, I mean, this 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 week right here, up and you know, from now till Thursday, is a lot about development. You know, so uh, you know, some of our older guys are going to get a lot of individual work, but when we go to team periods, we want to. You know, I want to see some of these young offensive linemen uh, get in there and, you know, have to step up and start getting ready to play. Yeah, it's, an, you know, an experiment. Wanted to try today. Just, an, uh, you know, an experiment for him. I mean, we have an All-American graduating at left tackle. So, uh, you know, right now there's just true freshmen uh, looking at it behind him. So, um, you know, something we want to look at for the next couple of days. And, uh, you know, I mean, James will be playing D-tackle for the bowl game. We just want to try to do that. We move some people to say, you know, move a couple corners over to safety to try some things. And, uh, just see what's going on. See what the people can do. John Banks is a safety today. Lewis Watson will try to safety. Yeah, yeah, just jostling some guys around here and there oh, just, just to get some experience and see what guys can do. What are you, what are you trying to do with the receivers with the chat out now? Uh, you know, right now, I mean, a couple of young guys that are going to get a lot of reps over this week. Uh, you know, and, and this is their opportunity to stand, to step up. And, uh, you know, for the game, we're going to have to see. As, as, as it gets going here closer to the bowl game, we'll, we'll figure out the game plan part of it. Uh, we'll just go uh, home and show the So we'll get back to hit. And, you know, kind of treating this kind of like training camp a little bit. You know, I mean, the first day, come out of helmets and put some pads on and, uh, and go to the full pads on Sunday. No, I, you know what? We have time. Uh, you know, and, and some guys, you know, they still have depth. Sam Williams starting to get a lot more healthy, and Mike Carr now has a year under his belt, so he's, he's a veteran, so uh, we should be okay depth wise. Have not completely ruled him out, but I mean, we'll, we've completely ruled him out until we get to the bowl side. You know, I mean, if, if anything, we'll know him. We, we, we won't know anything until we get to the bowl side. Yeah, I don't think so. I, you know, they said he could start to do some things, but uh, that's not so, you know that's not something we need to mess around with. Uh, you know, uh, for us in the long term picture, and we want to make sure uh, that's one. I, I want him a hundred percent before he gets out, because uh, you know where he'll be, it's only going to be for a couple practices that he'd get back into the rotation. I heard you giving somebody a geography quiz back there about a time zone of their story on that. Yeah, we've done. You know, we gone. We went and played in the Eastern Time Zone for a game or two this year. So, you know, the clocks change when you do that. So we had a little quiz for some guys when we land, and you know, we do some some little things like that to make sure. You know, some of our kids have never left the state of Mississippi. So, um, first time they get on a plane is when we get on a plane to go play a road game. So. Um, we try to keep them as worldly as possible. Were you able to tour the uh, North Florida side? Um, yeah, you know what? Unfortunately, I got there enough. And uh, a great practice facility. Um, hotel's a great layout for us for meeting rooms. Uh, you know, fortunately, I've, I've been to that hotel before for games, so we kind of uh, know the, the meeting room layout, uh, how everything works. But the, the practice site is fantastic for us. Uh, I mean, you're not going to play in a bigger type stadium, you know, to get playing that, it, that quality deal. So, I mean, everything's really first class from what I saw yesterday. Weather depending, going inside tomorrow. Or... Yeah, we're not going to we're not going to be silly out here uh, with with a lot. You guys are grateful. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, you know, I mean, so far from the game. You know, I mean, if it was game week or something, we could possibly we'll get used to playing back outside. But uh, if it's Cold's not going to put us inside uh, as much as, you know, rain or bad weather. We want to have a good practice. With all the, the crazy coaching rumors everywhere, do you address your team about that at all or anything, talk to them about it? Don't worry about it. I mean, I don't live in a speculation world. You know, we live in a real world, so uh, that's all we deal with. None of them asked you about it or anything? 